Hello all my lovely friends out there. This is Shilpi. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I make videos on motherhood, pregnancy, lifestyle, wellness and beauty. And in this video, I'm going to share what I pack in my diaper bag for my infant who is uh, seven months old and my preschooler who is almost going to be five years old. So I carry just one bag for myself as well as for my both the kids. This is my diaper bag. I got this from the diaper company. First thing that I've attached is a travel size sanitizer it just hangs from my bag and uh, kept these wipes here they fit perfectly in the side pockets for easy access then this side i've kept my water bottles i have opted for a spout water bottle so even if i don't carry a water bottle for my son he can just sip through this what i prefer is to keep everything separate in uh, different bags for all three of us so that it's easy to access and we can we can just take out that bag and do everything and then put it back instead of utilizing the compartments that is built in, in this bag so that's what has worked for me the first thing that i've kept here is some extra diapers i have kept two diapers here on the top and then i have a changing pad this came with the diaper itself and uh, it can be wiped clean with some damp cloth or wipe it's a decent size uh, changing pad and uh, it's very convenient so i kept this diaper changing pad and some diapers and there are wipes on on the outside of my bag as well as a sanitizer so this is all you need for a quick diaper change then going on i kept this kind of waterproof pouch for my daughter and one i have kept for my son in my daughter's pouch uh, what i have kept are again two diapers travel size wipe sanitizer bottle a change of cloth for her i try to carry a uh, bottoms and uh, top separate so that if there's a need to change just the bottom so i can just go with this or if i need to change give her entire outfit change then i can use these both so that's why i don't carry a onesie or a footed onesie with you know zippers and everything because i have faced issues where just i need to change the bottoms or sometimes the mess can also go on the shirt so i just need to change the shirt so uh, keeping it separate is a good idea then i kept a pair of socks and i also kept her some hats little size diaper rash cream i have also kept a burp cloth uh, to clean up any mess or spit up along with that i have kept a changing pad liner it's a waterproof one so it's very lightweight and compact so i keep it in this pouch so if i want to carry this pouch only for diaper changing so i can just take it out and i don't have to take out the main changing pad from my diaper bag as i also kept a bib for her because uh, she's now seven months old and she started eating solids so then i kept a wet bag for her for dirty cloths and then i have kept some fragrant disposable diaper trash bags this i got from dollar tree so these are like fragrant so if you are in a situation where you cannot throw the dirty diapers like if you are changing in a car uh, then this comes in handy all these things easily fit into this pouch then the next thing in my diaper bag is a muslin cloth a muslin blanket i got it from target in a set of 3 so i always keep this in my bag uh, this can be used as a blanket as a nursing cover you can use to cover up place if you want to keep your child down for some changes then this can be used it's very handy and it's very compact and lightweight so it doesn't add that much weight to your bag a muslin blanket is one in all so i keep this and in extra i also keep a lightweight breastfeeding cover this is just a plain uh, cloth in india we call it as a dupatta or a channi it's made up of chiffon so it's breathable so if i want to cover up by breastfeeding so this comes in very handy so these both things i keep uh, why i keep both of them because uh, if i'm breastfeeding i need to cover up and also uh, get tend to sleep so i like to put a blanket on her so that's why these two i keep next thing i keep for her in my diaper bag is a portable sound machine i have uh, i've already shown in my how i organize my space with my daughter so uh, i got this kind of led lights Uh, these are stick-on lights from Amazon, and I just stick it on this so that I can, if I am in a need of anything, any kind of light, I can just turn this on. And this particular 
uh, portable white noise machine is from summer brand it has got these five kind of noises volume button and vibration mode uh, and it also got hooks to hang to put it on the car seat or wherever they're sleeping so this is very handy and very useful next thing i keep in my diaper bag is kind of a toy or rattle for her uh, this is from the newbie brand i love this toy because it's very soft it's very lightweight they can chew on it uh, it has got all these things like teeters she can chew on it and plus the, the main purpose of this toy is so when you press it it makes kind of a loud sound so what i found with my daughter and also with my son when he was an infant is uh, when they are in an episode where they freak out and they just lose control of their emotions and they're crying out loud some kind of loud noise or distraction helps them to you know Get, take a break from that kind of emotion so this always comes in handy when she's in the car seat and somehow she is like sleepy or she's tired or she has she wants something and she's cranky i just take it out and i, just, I press it and she gets startled and for a second she just forgets that and then you can engage her into some other activities so this is very soft also and this is very lightweight so then the next thing that i've kept in my diaper bag is for my son i kept this uh, waterproof pouch for him it's a smaller in size uh, since he's four year old and he's fully potty trained so i don't need to carry much for him i i've just kept a change of clothes for him i've kept a shirt slacks or bottom so undergarments and pair of socks disposable travel wipes as a block bag to carry his dirty cloth bag. so all these things fit into this pouch for my son the next thing in my diaper bag are some snack items that i like to carry for my daughter since she has started already started solid so i keep this kind of a snack pouch in my bag in the snack pack what i've kept is a pouch for applesauce then i have kept some raisins for her then I have kept this kind of small food container. It's leak proof and it's very sleek. Uh, so if I want to take out this applesauce and feed her, I can use this or if I want to put any other snack in it, it would be easy and convenient for me to feed. And also if there are any leftovers, I can just seal it and there won't be any leakage. Some tissue paper or paper towel. Then I have kept a bib for her. This is the wipe clean one it doesn't have a fabric material this is a reusable one uh, in addition i have also kept some wipes i have also kept one disposable spoon i have kept her pacifier also in her snack bag she doesn't take pacifier she's teething and she wants to chew on something so uh, i give her this pacifier and she's like satisfied for some time I keep one water bottle for both of my kids or just for my daughter because this uh, this is a very uh, nice product that I got from Skip Hop. This is one side it's a straw and the other side it's a sippy cup. So this water bottle I keep it in my bags all set. In addition to these things I've also kept uh, some disposable bibs for her because sometimes the food is kind of messy and you, know, you don't have a place to clean it up. So in those situations I use this and I just toss it away. So the last person is me. I have kept something for myself also in this bag. So in this place I have kept my wallet and here only I keep my keys and stuff like that. Uh, in this pouch, in the front pouch, I have kept some of the my toiletries like a chapstick travel size sunscreen, travel size moisturizer, a travel size face wash. In addition, I also keep a comb, a hair tie and a clutch. Also a must in my diaper bag is this antiseptic lotion or cream. If you are anyone from India, you know this this brand, this Boroline. This is a very old uh, and I think a staple in many Indian household. Uh, it's an antiseptic cream that's good for wounds, cuts, chap lips, scraped knees and anything and any way. So this is a must and uh, in case of diaper rashes also it's very good. Though my both the kids have uh, never experienced diaper rash and uh, I have shared what I do to prevent diaper rashes. If you haven't watched my newborn essential video, it, the link would be somewhere here. So I've also kept a, a small size umbrella because weather is so unpredictable it can rain anytime. Then I keep this sunglasses case. It is I got this from India. It's the fast track brand 
uh, it's very lightweight and it's very spacious it fits all our sunglasses like my sunglasses uh, my kids sunglasses as well as my husband's sunglasses in future i'll add my daughter's sunglasses also so it's, it fits all the sunglasses and still it got space so it's a very nice compact sunglass case it's always there in my diaper bag since the pandemic uh, i also like to keep a extra mask for everybody in my bags if we forgot then um, there's always a backup also there's this compartment in my bag where i like to keep snack for us these are all travel snacks i like i keep a pack of nuts any granolas any chips oreos and uh, some mini but peanut butter cookies a fruit nut bar that's all in my diaper bag trust me it saves me so much time whenever we are rushing out of the house i don't have to pack individually so many items i my bag is all set i, I just need to make a quick check of the diapers that's outside because i generally don't like to use the diapers that are that are in the pouch i use the diaper that is outside so once that is used outside i try to remember and replace them uh, but if, even if i forgot i know there's a backup in my pouch so we are always covered up so this is what i uh, do and it has been like 4 years since i've been using this using the diaper bag with my first kid and then uh, my second so this kind of strategy always keeps me prepared and it's like it's the bare minimum that you need it's not overboard it's not underboard it's just the basics that you need and hopefully you will like this video if you like my content do like share and subscribe to my channel for more videos on motherhood pregnancy lifestyle wellness and beauty i hope to make further videos so do keep watching my space for more and thanks for all your love and support see you next time in my next video bye bye